welcome green oil cleanser wax dry loop wet loop and a brush let's get into this welcome welcome to james social cycle <music> people welcome welcome to green oil now if you remember I did a video a couple of videos ago on this uh, green oil so you have the chain cleanser or cleaner you got a wet loop and you got a dry loop dry loop I'm going to put on to the Trekamonda which is my indoor bike at the moment wet loop I'm going to put on said top stone and as you can see it is dirty so I need to give it a bit of a clean and I will use said chain cleaner on said chain and um, stick the wet lube on and let's see how it goes the jockey wheels were creaking a good un. creaking a good un today so uh, yeah let's see how this goes so I don't usually do this this way, but because I'm trying out the um, green oil cleanser, chain cleaner cleanser, train, I'm not doing his skin. I'm not doing his skin, am I? No. So I'm doing the cl so doing the cleaner, using the chain cleaner. So let's uh, let's do it this way first. Let's do it this way first. utilize the uh, green oil chain cleaner so let us now dry the bike and get to make sure the chain is clean we we'll see how it goes from there all right and then we will apply the uh, wet lube So I have stuck a layer of the green oil wet lube on so I can test this out over the next few weeks as now um, I am out and about, so which is really good. And next up, I'm just going to put some of the dry lube, the wax onto the Emonda chain, which I'm gonna clean that, um, take that off the bike and clean that. And uh, then I can give you some lowdown on that as well. But uh, the Amonda looking a little bit weird, the rear tyre on, and also the aero bars. I'm not getting aero, don't worry. It's actually just so I can rest while I'm riding um, on the trainer. So we have got the green oil wax. So this is the dry chain wax. So funny enough, just looking at the chain, it's absolutely minging. So it needs a clean anyway. 
and I'm going to basically apply this and while I'm riding this indoors I can give it a try so um, that's where we are with this at the moment I think what would be really interesting on this as well is because at the moment I've used muck off dry loop on this chain and the reason for that is because I was indoors but look how minging the chain is considering I've only ridden indoors all right that is how bad the chain is really mucky and that's not even been riding outside it'll be really um, it'll be really good to see how this um, wax handles indoor cycling so why green oil well simple sustainably sourced biodegradable fluids more than I can say for the stuff I clean the chain with on this occasion but then I do recycle my white spirits you've got new thick 150 kilometer formula you've got 100 percent recycled bottle and vegetarian bike lube okay and let's not forget this is non-harmful product for you and the environment PTFE free and PTFE is proven to be carcinogenic causes cancer not good people let's see what it looks like on the chain whilst applying it's in focus right giving it a good shake and be gentle with it people obviously my kitchen's dusty hey. it's the same as a squirt sometimes it doesn't come out and then it flies out <laughs> people job done so I've managed to apply both wet and dry chain um, I used a different method to clean the chain on that uh, on the Amanda due to just cleaning the chain if I was cleaning the bike then I'd have utilized the chain cleaner but the chain degreaser seemed okay so it got rid of all the dirt on the other chain so off the top stone and all I can say is that we'll give it a uh, a ride and um, I'll be riding this indoors two or three times in the week and I'm out again tomorrow on the top stone so we can um, keep a check and see how that goes all right and I'll be back to you with my thoughts in the next let's say a couple of weeks shall we let's give it a chance let's give it a chance all right any questions down below don't forget like subscribe all that rubbish I've been very busy of late so um, I can understand why a lot of my videos aren't getting seen really but then that's YouTube for you that's YouTube for you um, me being unwell over Christmas and everything so uh, it seems to be and now being busy with work so but hopefully I'll bring you some more stuff soon enough all right lots of love I'll see you on the road very soon